Hello and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. My name is WWE Deadman, but you already know that. Um, yeah, let me take this moment to say that Daddy Longlegs is the shittiest designed boss in the entire fucking universe. And I literally want to punch the developers of this game in the face for the inclusion of it. Good, uh, we've got a pretty fancy hairstyle. We've got the Halo of Lies, we've got Lemon Mishap. That's the seed if you want to play along. We have like no tier rate, a whole lot of shot speed and decent damage. Halfway decent at least. Come here. Vision. Let me see that. Okay, since this is a, an XL floor, uh, this was actually worth it. God! Don't! Don't do that! Don't run towards me! Don't go all... Uh, kamikaze on me! What the hell? You're not molly booms, you're not suicide bombers. Oh, we have exactly one heart. Nice, we're dead. <laughs> Fuck you, game! In the ass with a rake made of splintering wood, spiked with fucking razor blades that are rusty. And stained with the blood of your enemies. Or friends. Or whatever. Someone with some nasty disease, probably. God! Not that stupid! I was about to say, if you give me the lost, I'm going to fucking kill you. <laughs> ah, Curse of Darkness. Ugh. No. That's just not happening. <laughs> Hold R to reset like that in case you don't know. <sighs> oh yeah, by the way, um, that's your seed if you want to play along. Stop spawning shit! God damn it! Go fuck yourself! Also, I like never random Isaac, so that's cool. Okay. Item room, maybe. Ah. Fuck you. Lovers. I hate you, game. I hate you so much. No. I'm probably not gonna get to reroll again. Hmm, nice. So, of course, I'm going to keep these for after the boss fight because I wanna guarantee a devil room on the next floor 
And that's most easily done by having a bunch of soul hearts to protect your red hearts. And since this is, this is the first floor, I'm not uh, in any danger of dying. I mean, I have three health. Even if I do something stupid like that, I'm not dying. Um, yeah. That gives us another soul heart? Nice. Also gonna give us a cube of meat or a ball of bandages. Can't keep doing that till tomorrow. Also, I like how you don't have an animation before you shoot. Okay, let's go collect some health. And then let's go into the next floor. I'd really like to find the um, boss room right away. Curse of the Unknown. I don't know my... Jokes on you, now I have something that actually does damage. Fish head. Response flies each time we get hit. Get rid of those fires because I'm pretty sure I need to go through here again and then I don't want uh, to potentially get shot at. Nice. No. No. <laughs> uh, not in a hundred years. Uh, occasional poison shots. Definitely better than spawning flies every time we get hit. Because I don't plan on getting hit much. Mostly. Um, and then I'm gonna clear out the rest of the floor because I do want a re-roll for the um, devil room. Okay, so let's look in here. Mom's key, that would be really nice to have. Let's see. Uh, first of all, I want to have a look at the boss and the devil room. Mom's key would, of course, increase the drop. Uh, or the drops uh, we get from chests and golden chests. So they essentially drop all the loot with that item. Yes. 
Yes. Yes. <laughs> and yes. <laughs> uh, and I guess a range up isn't the worst, so I'm gonna take that too. And then I'm actually gonna have a look at the um, big room over there. So yeah, two out of three orbitals, a whole lot of damage, fear shot, bunch of uh, six uh, black hearts from that uh, Abaddon, by the way. We're now exclusively on soul and black hearts, which is also cool. And we've got a sacrificial dagger, and we're one third guppy. Sacrificial dagger rotates around us just like the cube of meat. Also, we have double drops. Yeah, that's the thing. That's the contract from below. Um. So, actually getting mom's key would be like the greatest thing. Right now. So I'm pretty glad that I can. Could of course also have bumped the uh, pots there or here. But those are not guaranteed to drop any money. The donation machine is. And I of course do not need any money in the donation machine anymore. Really, apart from the bank value. Uh. That was probably one of the best devil deals I ever had, by the way. Then again, with the D6, it's really easy to get a good Devil Deal. Because <laughs> any Devil Deal with an item is probably going to be a good one. You know, the only thing that could have gone better, I could have gotten Goat Hat as one of the items. So um, uh, the rest of my Devil Deals would be guaranteed. Mulligan! Poor man's guppy! Now, occasionally when we hit with a tier we spawn a fly. That does, does double our damage. Like that one. Unlike guppy though, we don't spawn with every hit. So... Yeah. As I said, occasionally. I say okay too much. Um, I actually want health in that so we can actually get a devil deal if we get a devil deal. If that makes sense. Nice, free devil room item. <laughs> Two thirds copy. <laughs> and we got another devil root. And you're getting re rolled. <laughs>
Told you you're getting re-rolled. <laughs> Come on, Guppy. No, but flight. <clears throat> Almost as good as Guppy. Since that would be just an upgrade to fly spawning and... <clears throat> I don't even know. Do uh, Guppy's uh, fly spawning ability and the... Mulligan stacks, so you sometimes spawn two flies with one hit. Is that a thing? Because that would be cool. Because otherwise the mulligan is utterly useless as Guppy. Since it's literally the same effect, but not as frequent. There you are. Double locked room, we're gonna check that out. Okay. You're gonna drop a whole lot of stuff, yeah. I tell you, uh, Mom's key, a really nice thing. Also, there's a battery in there that's an extra reroll for this floor. <coughs> Which is nice since we do have uh, a shop to visit. Not gonna use this, so I might as well blow it up. Little haunt. Maybe. Pandora's box. This is a two soul hearts and a um, and a boss item. If I'm not completely wrong. Tears and shot speed up and. Yeah, that's cool. Buy that back. And then we're done here for this floor. Uh, there's another battery in there, isn't there? Nope. Good. Just making sure. So yeah, I'm re-rolling um, Little Haunt. First I know. There's a reason I re-rolled that in the one dice room uh, last, uh, second to last run. That one Eden run this week. <laughs> <clears throat> that one of the three Eden runs. Although you can't really call that one in this episode a run. So yeah, um, if we get another devil deal, I want a um, reroll ready. So I'm going to do do more. Do 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 do. do. I'm going to do two more fighting rooms. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Okay, let's check out the boss. Remember, we can uh, reroll twice for the boss item. Also, we can reroll the um, item room again if we want to. Or if we want to keep the boss item or whatever. Oh yeah, you're the one that only spawns shit. Totally forgot. I hate you. That 
That's a health up. I don't want a health up necessarily. That's an evil range and shot speed up. That's better. And the last reroll of the day goes to... Or of this floor, not of the day. The item room, of course, but uh, yeah. You probably already figured that out yourself. Prop fucking Tosis! <clears throat> yeah, can you say one run? I'm gonna assume that this is the game's way of saying sorry for that Eden start. Nice. Nice. Nice! Even if that's gonna cost me half a heart each time I get uh, one of the batteries, that's two more rerolls on this floor. Also, we have a uh, uh, a um, uh, forty-eight hour energy pill in the uh, in the rotation, which is pretty damn awesome. <sighs> That's almost worth it, you know, since we have uh, mom's key. Got nine bombs, I might as well do this. No black hearts cards or anything, really. I'm gonna check out the shop since I can. No. BFF. Uh, oh, wait, no. Uh, that's hive mind. That's fine too. I spawn flies. Now I spawn giant flies. Also, there's another battery in here in case we need that. This is. I'm a moron. I wanted to bless this. Ah. Uh, Ha what even hit me the second time? There was nothing there anymore that could hit me! Oh yeah, I forgot those assholes still hit you when they're in their dying animation! <sighs> die, motherfucker, die. I don't even want to reroll that. Um, and I might as well take the second level cube of second level cube of meat and that tinted rock. And then look for the item room. Now, of course, since we have hive mind, my flies now do uh, four times my damage, and any attack spiders that we might spawn at at some point do five times my damage, which is a whole lot considering. Ha! <laughs> 
Now we didn't even fucking waste a charge of DT6 since we ended up with a charge right for this. Nice! 1.5 times damage multiplier. Yeah, so I don't even need anything else. Just gonna take what I have and leave. So this floor, of course, we want to explore the entirety of the floor before going to the boss. Lovers. Utterly useless unless we find a uh, Blackheart uh, top secret room. Because I am not going to take any help ups anymore from now on. Forty-eight hour energy, awesome. Use one, take the other one with you. Lockdown. Range up, okay. Also, we're at full health. rerolls so I'm gonna touch this just to get it out of every pool even though that's pretty cool but and yeah um, mask of infamy would make us uh, not get hit uh, when getting hit by tears sometimes but yeah screw that copy also apparently this really wants me so I'm gonna take it And I'm gonna keep the 48 hour energy pill actually for the uh, chest because I have no doubt that we're gonna go to the chest this run. I'm completely overpowered already. Speed up, don't need more speed. There's no need for speed right now. Also, we do like insane amounts of damage now with all the flies. And stuff. I just one shot that dude. Okay, I don't want to do the boss before doing the rest of the floor. Because we can't get out of the mom fight. Unless we have a teleport lying around somewhere, and we currently don't. Um. That's poison bombs, which actually gives us five more bombs on top of the poison effect on our bombs, so I'm going to take that. And I might as well re-roll Guppy's head. Goat head. Troll head. Always comes when we don't really need it anymore. Uh, don't need anything from here. I'm going to blow this up. Nice key. Book of Revelations, not necessary at all. Going to reroll that. If I get the chance. Which it doesn't seem like unless I have a battery in here. I have a battery in here, indeed. Health up, nope. Even with uh, two devil rooms to come, I'm not going to take health ups anymore. 
Yeah, that's what I wanted to use that for. Totally. I love you too, game. Top secret room. Top secret room. Okay, then not. What? What? Guppy's tail. Pills. Another 48 hour energy. Well, uh. And a health up. Um. Then I might as well. Reroll this. I guess. Brimstone! <laughs> if I didn't have such great fucking tears, I would take it. But my tears are too great to take brimstone right now. Sorry, Brim. Ah, uh, and as I said, I want to keep my 48-hour energy pill for the chest. Thanks for wasting my special item counter. Ah, uh, I feel like I get brimstone every s second run. Like, every run I have uh, a lot of devil deals, I'm pretty much going to get it. Might be because the last two times I got it, I had the D6, I think. At least. Nope. <sighs> of course, I could have taken Guppy's tail. But... Mother of fuck! I didn't touch that. But really, I don't need more just drops. Uh, you know my flies. You too. I don't need a health up. Flies OP. <sighs> Guppy hive mind is just completely overpowered and broken. I mean, I'm literally gonna walk into the Blue Baby and Isaac fights and just stand there. Do nothing. Because I'm not gonna need to do anything. Not gonna shoot in there. That me means unless I lost all my flies somehow before that fight. But I'm pretty sure I'm gonna just stand in there and do nothing. Same for the heart. And whatever boss we've got, we're getting on this floor. See, I one-shot that dude before he gets his in his invincibility. Oh, how fucking ah! That felt good. <laughs> More damage, and I might as well. You know, that is actually a one-shot blue baby combo, but just seeing it doesn't remove it from the uh, normal item room pool, which means I still can get it on the uh, chest, because that is totally not a uh, devil room exclusive. Razor blade. Are you even trying? Uh, 
By the way, tender rocks? Nope. There's a tender rock though. I didn't even touch that! Fix your fucking hitbox this game! Nope. But I'm happily gonna reroll that. Nope. Don't need that. That's essentially the old... Uh, no, I don't need more speed. Uh, the, the effect of Samson's lock is still the same it was in the uh, old game. Which is a worse uh, version of the old game's... Um, uh, of the old game's bloody lust. All the loot. <sighs> There's another 48 hour energy. Luck up. Health up. Paralysis. Okay, so. Tooth shot. Don't get that very often. <laughs> no. <laughs> I have no idea how the guy didn't hit me, but I hit him. Yeah, that's kind of what I expected to happen. Didn't even need to shoot. My flies took care of that. That's what I expect to happen for the uh, Blue Baby and Isaac fights as well. Hi, Hon. You're even trying. Because it doesn't seem like you're trying. Could have been an item. <laughs> that monster didn't. That monster never spawned. That was just a death animation on a sprite that never spawned in. <laughs> That's a highlight. <laughs> <laughs> I think I broke the game. Okay, unlimited keys for the floor. Not like I need that really. I have so many keys I could open literally every chest in the game. this run. 
Okay. Oh yeah, just stand here and wait. Okay, let's get a couple of rerolls here. Uh. So magic mushroom is a 0.3 damage up and a health up in this case. Also pretty much every other stat up, but uh, I really don't want health right now. So I'm going to reroll it since I don't get the damage multiplier since I already have that from Cricket's head. I don't want the health up, I said. Um, I'm going to take the lucky foot because it's a luck up and I'm going to reroll the rest. Don't need homing bombs. Fat protector, not really. Uh, that's a range up, so I'm gonna take it. Ow. Also, uh, I took uh, the... <laughs> I took Midas touch because uh, every time you... Uh, touch an enemy you make you, know, you do damage uh, uh, equal to the amount of coins you have so I currently do 52 contact damage to every enemy I come in contact with plus I have the um, okay uh, plus I have the sh shield from the Polaroid and I have a Sacrificial dagger and a um, Super meat boy hat that both do a whole lot of damage when coming into contact with enemies, so I Gotta say this is a pretty neat build. Uh, I'm gonna reroll the one item that's still lying around Of course, we're going to definitely nope uh, Clear out the entire floor, so Might as well do that here yeah, that's getting rerolled. Come on, don't give me empty rooms. Those are not very entertaining. Cancer? Hell yeah. Ironically, Cancer is a... Uh, is better the more tiers you already have, so... With my tier rate, this is actually pretty damn awesome. Ludo no! How about Ludo no, Vico? I didn't even get to say high bloat. Come on, at least drop me one item. Or like one set of chests since you're gonna drop me two no matter what. Okay, so we're going to look for the top secret room and the secret room Top secret <sighs> Inviting but screw you <laughs> Sad on the end Didn't we already have that? I thought I already had I, I, I seriously thought I oh or was that I think that was last run. That could be. Um, yeah, so secret room. Not there. Um, how about here? Empress. Well, uh... 
Yep. I was looking for uh, um, pills in those um, mushrooms, so yeah. Yep, uh, I'd say like and favorite if you enjoyed. <laughs> Subscribe for more, and until next time, I'm WW Dadman. Bye.